What up YouTube and welcome back to the long dark today We're making our first real attempt at interloper and I have to say it's our luckiest run yet I really hope you enjoy the video if you do drop a like it helps me out very very much and with the intro out of the way Let's get to it All right, where are we? Been a couple days been a couple weeks since I pay played been a couple hours since I talked. Desolation Point. I can handle Desolation Point, I think. I hear the ocean. That's always a good sign. If I recall... Ocean sounds like it's this way. If I recall... Actually, I really don't have any idea where we are. Um, let me see here. Let's... While I'm up this way, because I don't think I'm coming back. Let's grab a couple sticks... Let's get ourselves, um, like I said, a couple sticks. I'm going to grab the lichen and uh, kind of see what we can do for ourselves in terms of resources before we head down to the lighthouse. Probably going to base there since we're in the, the desolation of points. Uh, it's been a couple, it's been a couple weeks since I played. Um, life got busy, and, uh, and then OBS updated, which is the software I use to record and screen capture. That's right, we're over by this cave, um, this mining area. But OBS, um, screwed up all my audio, so if the audio sounds different, that's why, because it is different. I'm gonna grab these stones, grab a couple more sticks. I'm running around like a chicken with their head cut off because it's cold as all hell. And there are some of these rose hips over here. We'll grab them. I'm going to try to see if I can gr if there's anything interesting inside this cave. Uh, like right in the entrance. Because perhaps maybe there's a bedroll or something. I don't know. There's definitely some coal, right? I don't know. Those are rocks. Okay. Is there anything underneath the tool chest? We'll check the drawers real quick. I am warming up, so it's not the worst place to be. But I'll take those. No frostbite for our hands. Is that box of matches? Oh, yeah. This is a luckier find. This seems to be a luckier run than we did last time. Assume... <clears throat> This seems to be a luckier run than we're having last time. We found it, uh... Fuck, I can't talk, man. This seems to be a luckier run than we did last time, as I found matches, like, two minutes in. I want to wear these. God, I don't remember how to play this game. Alright, cool. So that's good. We're warming up. I don't want to sit in here too long. We're not going to get anywhere in the dark here. So, I think we're going to head back outside. Uh, maybe we start a fire real quick. Probably not a terrible idea. What am I missing? Probably some tinder. Let's go back inside. Yeah, let's try to do that. Let's get a fire going with the few sticks that I have. I could pull a couple torches from it. Maybe we walk through this cave, just see if there's anything of interest before we head over to the lighthouse. So I'm going to do that real quick. Let's go ahead and harvest a couple tinder plugs. That'll heat us up. And we'll back outside. Open this will hold. And we'll just do it right over here. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. 12 matches. Hopefully it lights on the first go. The luck holds out, please. And then I think on the opposite side of this fence, there may be a backpack that I recollect from last time I was in Desolation Point. Looking good. Looking good. All right. Add some fuel. Just the sticks for now. I'm going to pull a torch and we'll put that out. Put that away. Don't walk over it. Take another torch real quick. I do want to just check and see if there is that backpack over here. Oh, there's one of these though. I'll take it. 
I could have sworn there was one. Perhaps it was um, out over here somewhere. Any other sticks I can grab quick? Add some fuel. All right. I'm going to pull basically the rest of these torches. Let's do that now. And then we're going to head through this cave. We got one more? Yeah, I can't do it on four minutes, so let's go back in. All right, we got some light. I'm going to kind of run through here quick. I'm not going to spend a lot of time in here. Getting the coal is a good move. More coal down here. If I recall, this cave's actually fairly large. I did kind of mosey my way through it last time, so I'm not going to do that now. We're going to basically beeline it through as fast as we can, but there's no way I'm leaving all this coal behind. Even if I have to start another fire, uh, I think two matches is probably not a terrible sink into what we could potentially find inside the cave here. Go. We're heading through to the other side. Gonna pick up this coal here. I think I can get through this cave on one, maybe two torches. I definitely can get through. If it takes me two to get through to one side. Nope, nope, we're good. We're here now. Oh no, this is the midway point. Got anything of interest here? Not that I thought that was a fire barrel. Take that. Anything there? Any hacksaws, anything of note. Backpack. I'm slowing down, so I think I got a lot of coal on me. Nothing. All right. What you got for me, Flair? Nope. Okay, gonna keep running. Take that. Take that. And that. And that. Not gonna leave any of this coal behind. All right, maybe I'll leave some of it behind. We'll see. I'll try to drop it at like an entrance or so. So it can allow some of the others to respawn too. All right, we're gonna go through here and then we're gonna relight the torch. Oh, come on, come on. Uh, yeah. Little rusty, little rusty. Grab that on the way back. Okay, cool. We're here. And anything on the shelf? Nope. Maybe there's a jacket. All right, nothing. And nada. I don't want to go to Crumbling Highway right now. So we're going to head back to Desolation Point. Like I said, I think the... um. Getting the fire was a good move because that's also going to help us with dealing with wolves. Because uh, Desolation Point does have quite a bit of wolves around. So we could scare them off with the fire, the torch, and um, a couple of these stones. Alright, we're back here at the midpoint of the cave. I searched all that. I did search this drawer, I believe, right? Yeah. And one last check underneath. Sure I didn't miss. Nothing there. Just doing a once over one more time. We'll squeeze through here. And then we're pretty much out of here. If I could beeline it now to... I'm thinking. If I could beeline it to um, the lighthouse, that's kind of good. But also, if I were to maybe go check out Katie's last stand. Oh, you bastard. Bet you it's too windy. Yeah, of course it is. All right, well. Put that away.
we're gonna head straight to the lighthouse. Screw Katie and her last stand because I don't want to be out in this blizzard. And we may die anyways because I only been in this area one time. So I assume this leads to the road. If I can get to the road, we should be safe enough to get from the road back to the ocean and get to the lighthouse that way. I just gotta be careful about my ears. I don't want any frostbite. That's a fool's, uh, that's not where I wanna go. It's down here. Oh, a car. Can this keep me warm for a few minutes? No. Can I get a hat, please? Negative. All right, anything behind the visors? Nothing there. Yeah, I get you, hyperthermia in the back of my mind. All right, we can get to the lighthouse, no problem. Shouldn't be any wildlife with the uh, with the storm. Hell, if the storm acts, if the storm continues, I may even go to Katie's or the church. Fence. I think the church is up this way. I could start a fire in the church if I need to and then warm up from there and then head over to Desolations Point. While I'm here, we might as well check it out. As we'll warm up a little bit in here as well. I'm not going to go far. I'm not taking any more coal either. We're good for now. We'll come back in here. Uh, nope. Got anything for me? Nothing on the shelf. Nothing there. Okay. God, I'm not seeing much. I'm not seeing anything, really. And I'm not heading down there to the other side of the, the cave. This is no real reason to right now. We're going to check the church. Which is not down, but over. Check the church. I'm going to grab these mushrooms. And then we're going to head this way to the church. It's, it's so much better when you know a region. I mean, this is a smaller region anyways. Like, it's pretty straightforward. You get a road, you follow the road. But, man, is it just, it's nice to know where you're going. Some more mushrooms. We'll grab them quick. If I can click. All right, and into the church we go. Is there anything of interest in here? One can hope. Grab this. What would be kind of interesting is if, like, to get out of the weather, the wolves would sometimes go in here, like, into the building. As kind of like a den. Take that for fire. This is true interloper, no gun loper this time. So the frontier shooting guide actually, I th is that, oh no, that's not an arrow, a bow and arrow one. Uh, I'll double check that, make sure I'm, I've got that correct. But the uh, frontier shooting guide, if that's for guns, we're gonna go ahead, we can use that as fuel. No real reason to read it. Um, Cause we don't have any guns. Anymore. I saw a stick. There it is. And we'll head back down this way. And then I believe that lighthouse should be basically across the street here. I got no more stamina though. All right, we're heading to the streets. And we'll head this way. Oh, I forgot Hibernia is in this area, too. We could always go there if we need. But that's a trek. I really don't want to go to Hibernia in the... Okay, I think... I don't think it's across that bridge. I think it's across this way. Not down here, but... I think it's closer to this direction.
If I have to, I could hunker down in the church, just don't have a means to sleep, while the lighthouse has a bed. I think I'm correct. I think this is the way to the lighthouse. We go down this way. Man, I'm so excited to be playing this game again. I, uh... The last, the last playthrough, even though it was Gunloper, just the challenge of Interloper was, it, it's so much more fun. Like, I didn't realize how much more fun I was having on Interloper than I was on the Stalker difficulties. Now, one of the reasons I don't enjoy the Stalker difficulty as much is because it's, you know what, I think the wolves just can tend to get it, like, tiresome and tedious. Uh, and, you know, I think... The wolves definitely get tiresome. The challenge isn't necessarily as much there, but I love the, the fact that you basically are, are forced to move so much in Desolation Point here. Or in Interloper. Can't walk and chew bubblegum at the same time. Alright, we're here. So, what is that? Ooh, let's put that up there. Cool. Uh, we'll go ahead and put this yeah i guess just here ish and then i'm dropping all that coal fire and 34 coal that's great i'm gonna drop these just a little bit too leave that plug for now do i start a fire Maybe. I'll think about it. Don't really need it right now. How uh, how are my afflictions? Hyperthermia risk and frostbite risk. Let's do a once through in this uh, in the lighthouse quick. And see what they come like what they give me. If I get a hat, I don't really think I need to worry so much about the frostbite risk. If I don't find a hat, then perhaps maybe we start a fire. We'll see. So searching these drawers, nothing in them. Oh, I stand corrected. The wolf, the, the wolf, the scarf will help. I wonder if that's going to change anything here. Keep kind of a track of those. That's on the P and the O. It's in between the two. There's two uh, little um, points there. We can sleep. Uh, emergency stim's good to have. We'll put this cooking oil in where we can see it. There's a note here. I'll pause for a second in case anybody wants to read it. Take it. Do you have it? Go. Anything else? No. Let's go. Up the stairs. Plastic container. Nothing. Anything hidden behind these crates? Nope. Seen anything. Nothing below there. Bag of ketchup chips. And what's that? Postal fish cakes. Crispy cakes of fish. Traditional style salty. Okay, let's definitely take that. We'll take the spray paint. Anything in these lockers? And cured leather, okay. I need to do like an inventory check on our shoes, see if there's anything uh, to, you know, what kind of gear we have. I didn't, I checked nothing. I basically was like, where are we? Desolation point, let's go. And anything of interest up here, sewing primer and nothing in there. All right, we'll do one more check outside. And nothing. All right, cool. Let's go back down. All right, heading back downstairs. Not seeing anything. All right, so the question becomes now, do we start a fire? It's going to get late. 
I think we do. So if we start a fire, we can go ahead and stock up on some torches. We can storm just die. Check. Okay. It's not as bad out. There's still a body down here? Yes, there is. With another scarf. Thank you. What's up, Dennis? Give me those shoes. No? Okay. Anything on the ice? Negative. Hmm. What do, what do we do? Because... We could go straight to the Riken. The weather's bad enough where the wolves haven't really had time to spawn in yet. We could get there before it clears out and sleep there. If I want to push it. Oh yeah, we're still getting cold. We're still too cold. Hmm. <laughs> I'm checking. Let's check our inventory real quick. Everything's soaking wet. We can put that on. That's soaking. That's frozen too. These are all wet. There's no real reason to press right now. We got plenty of fuel. I don't really want to use the torch. I mean, I don't really want to use the matches, but... I think we can make some water. We can make some oats. We've got food. We'll got we'll stock up on some water. I think the move is we stay here. We got plenty of of uh, fuel. We can cook some water. We can cook some food. Kind of get ourselves stocked up. Get a good night's rest, and then we'll just we'll have torches and everything ready to go for tomorrow to get over to the Riken and uh see what's there and um maybe even hibernia i'm gonna need a couple of these and then let's go ahead and light the torch perfect so that's good and let's go ahead and start it i got one tinder plug so hopefully this works 80% chance, so that's not terrible. Somebody searching container, I heard. Background. Perfect. We'll put this out. Put it away. Grab a couple more sticks. Grab a coal. We'll add the coal here. And a couple sticks. Perfect. Uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and... I think we're going to drop all this. Drop. Huh. Alright. Drop all our clothes. Um, how much time does that have? We'll get some water going. You know, I don't think we can actually cook this without a skillet. So, I'll try, but I don't think we can. And while those are all drying, hopefully they're close enough, I'm going to take a few minutes here. Let's scrap this. Let's go ahead and... Where is it here? Make another tinder plug. Go ahead and craft four of them. Cool, we'll check on this water. Oh, 19 minutes till boiled. Perfect. Let's go ahead and... I think we should... Uh, yeah, no, that's not what I want to do with these. Let's just take 30 minutes, so let's do one. Might as well get some teas going. Okay, and 
one minute to boil and we'll take it. We will cook some more water. And then we're gonna do another pass of reishis. And oh, I did not grab enough. I did not grab enough rose hips to prepare. Oh no. All right. I wasn't paying attention that far. Okay, we'll take that. How much water do we have? I'm just going to cook a little bit more. Uh, 0.26 gallons. Okay. Yeah, we don't have enough rose hips to be able to prepare any for tea. So we'll just stay on top of this fire here. I'll add another coal because I'm not going to be going to sleep right now. And I guess I'll keep two sticks on me just in case we need to give a couple minutes to this. And let's go ahead and pass again. And let's go ahead and cook. We might as well cook this reishi. And then I'm going to eat, I guess. Do I want to eat? I'm going to have to eat before we go to sleep, so no, not yet. All right, and that's still got an hour and a half. We'll take it. Go ahead and just cook as much water as we can. And I'm going to go ahead and drop this tea. Come on. Come on. It wants to do it for one second. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Okay. 25% wet. Is this dry now? It is. Okay. They're 5%. Right. Uh, uh, come on. There you go. Dry those off. 8 minutes. Uh, an hour 22. And we'll get these a little closer over there. Cool. That there, six minutes still boiled. Past time, let's take it. We got an hour left. Some water, and then let's see what we have here. I have the um, what is it called? The oil. Yeah, there you go. Go ahead and drop that. Put that there. Fifteen minutes on the melted snow, and an hour and eight minutes there. Ten percent wet. Pick these back up. We'll pick those back up and those back up and let's put them all on Go and then we just got that last scarf I'll throw over here and let's take this and There you go perfect that's stopped On top of the management here at the moment All right, we'll do, let's check outside real quick. See if there's, I think there was some more rose hips over this way. Yep. Perfect, some rose hips. Grab them. That's eight and eight. And is there any reason to go for a walk? No, not really. As, de as much as I want to get headed over to, as much as I'd like to head over to the Riken, we just chill. I don't want to be overzealous and, uh, and die. This out and head back inside. Okay, a couple more minutes there. 
And we'll take that and we'll put that back on too. I wonder if that counts. I doubt it having the two scarves, but we'll see. And yeah, I think at this point in time, I'm going to boil water till this. How much water do we have? 16 gallons. I'm going to try to get myself to at least a full gallon. So probably one more coal. Okay. One more coal's worth of fuel. And um, yeah, basically I'm going to try to just get a gallon of water before we try to, before we call it a night. Can I grab this can? Yep. Take that can quick. I'll take the tea and let's head upstairs so we can get some sleep and call it a night. And we'll be back at it in the morning. All right, it's the next morning and it sounds like there's a storm outside. I head down and see. See how bad it is before we head out. Ah, oh, another blizzard. Well, that's a good and bad thing because I should know my way to the Riken. So let's grab most of this coal. I'm going to grab all of it and then we'll drop off a couple pieces here. I'm going to take basically all the fire stuff except for that log. He can stay. Let's drop off, uh, let's keep eight pieces here. 10. Yeah, let's keep 10. And then I think we're gonna head out with that. And I think that's gonna do it. Don't really see anything else I'd want. Can I safely drop this way? Yeah, I could. I could make my way down here. That'll. Oh, is that a piece of wood too? Come on. I don't want to sprain anything. Is it? Yeah, I'll take the firewood. So I don't want to go. Ooh, I do. I do want to go over here. Crow feather. Crow feather, crow feather, and okay. He just died. Um, the lighthouse is here. I want to head this way. I would love to vent. Oh my god, I'm already cold. Just to top me up. And let's see. Yeah, we're heading, as, as long as I can see the rocks, we can always head back to the mainland if we need to. And the mainland, we can always follow the road back to the lighthouse, so. It'd be kind of tough to get too lost out here. But I do know if we keep heading this way, with the wind at our back, we should come across the Riken. don't remember this actually match truck where was match truck I'm trying to remember I'll take it though that'll do it uh, and what's it say please look for your brother and his friends I don't know what to do okay Okay, okay, yeah, I know where we are. Rankin's right there. Cool that the weather kind of died down. I'll leave the sticks up there. We are going to head over this way. It's a little early, I think, for the wolves to head out, so we should be good to make it over to the ship here. And then, yeah, already the deer are out. So, I imagine predators are going to start popping up for too long. I do want to head on the outskirts, too, because that's where all the goodies are that wash up on shore. But, for now, heading to the Riken, see what they got for us. Alrighty. 
I don't see anything over here. The crate. I don't see anything. What is that? Oh, is that a thermos? Oh, cool. We got a flask. That's cool. I'd like to collect all those if we can. I don't know if they're all in Interloper or if it's, you know, just one or two here and there. Uh, the lockers here. How dark is it? It's fairly dark. But I can I can see fair. Okay. We got a fishing uh, fishing book. Anything under the shelf? No. Nothing on top of the shelf. Nothing hidden to the side here. We do have the first aid kit. And there's nothing in it. We'll check this file cabinet. Some more matches. That's a good find. Some newspaper. I'll take it just to get us... Because we're light on Tinder right now. Uh, I don't think there's a lot of cattails, if any, in this area. So, um, having... We're not going to have, like, a... We're not going to be loaded up on... Um, cattail like the tinder plug whatever the cattail heads i think are the tinder part i think we eat the stalks i should pay more attention to what the specifics are i was hoping to maybe find a heavy hammer in here uh but i'm not seeing it maybe it's upstairs take that and we'll drop we're definitely gonna drop off some um hole in here Real quick. Probably most of it. Yeah, I'm going to drop off 20 pieces. And then the rest I can keep. And then I know if we ever do come this way to forge. If we do come back this way to forge. I will have... I'll be... We'll have plenty of coal. I'm assuming. 20 pieces should be enough to get the forge going and allow us to make whatever we need to make. All right, up here in the cabin, not seeing anything there. Nothing under the bed. Stand up, please. Thank you. Let's check this metal container. Nothing. Whole lot of nothing. Uh, nothing there underneath that bed. Some pork and beans. Okay. Anything on these shelves here? I uh, don't see nothing. And let's go outside. It is cold in this ship. And I didn't put that hat on yet, so I would like to do that. And then we'll kind of take a look, make sure uh, there's no bear on its way over here. And then I think we'll head over to Hibernia. Might as well clear this area as quick as we can. And this is to that memento over by Hiberi Hi Hibernia. And not, let's not forget that key. Real quick, before I forget, um, let's take this off. I take this off. Yeah, and let's put this on. And then that should hopefully pause that. Well, the hyperthermia is going to be there, but it will stop us from getting frostbite. And then let's go. I don't really want to go back inside if I can help it. I didn't. There's nothing else in there. And if I go back inside, we there's a chance to respawn the the. There's a chance for the the predators to spawn. I think every time we load the region. So by going back inside, I think there's a, a higher percent chance that we would bump into. A wolf or a bear over here on the ice on our way to Hibernia. I'm gonna pretty much beeline it there. There can be wolves around it, so I might need to light a torch if we run into one, but we'll see. Anything on these boats? Yep, there's a backpack. Come on. Don't fall into the the boat and get stuck please okay anything in that other boat the blue one no okay i saw a body over here by this cliff oh i thought i saw a body i guess it was like the rocks here we'll take the the karen there's a is that a locker 
How weak is this ice? Check it out. I think this is like one you can scrap. Is it gonna crack? Okay. It's holding. Nothing in the first locker. And nothing in the second. Cool. We'll head back over this way. I should be able to get up this platform here. And we're here at Hibernia. Just keeping my eyes peeled for any potential wolves. Where is he? I can make it in here. All right, let's check out in here first. I'm pretty cold anyways, and I'm pretty thirsty. Can I get a jacket, please? Okay, nothing in the corner over here. I am warm in here, which is nice. Let's see what we can do. Uh, these are all drying, which is fine. I'm going to need to sew some gear soon. I don't want to drink too much water yet. Uh, anything I can break down quick. We need a sewing kit, but once we get one, I'll probably be trying to repair as much gear as I can. And I can't use the bedroll. Can't break down the pillow either. Anything back here? The shelves are clear. Nothing in the crate. Uh, nothing in between these bed frames that I can see. Scrap there, but I can't pick it up. Uh, nope, don't need the cardboard box. Another old bedroll, which we can't break down because we don't have a knife. And what else we got here? Nothing in here. Some antiseptic. I don't think I really need that because I have the old man's beard. Search the plastic container up here, though. Okay, nothing. And there's not much down here either. Uh, whetstone? Okay, we'll take it. I can't stand. It won't let me stand. Interesting. I guess I crouch below this mattress and then can't get back up. Fun. That's fun. Top of the line game. Great job, Hinterland. What was over here? Is this door a separate side? Or is this just something I overlooked coming in here? Okay, it is. I just overlooked this door walking past it. Okay. Mm, I'm not seeing anything interesting. Sometimes there's a metal container, if I remember, over here. Those crates. We can go in the building here. And on the opposite side is that, that memento cache. I don't think I need those wires right now. I would, if we can, if we can last long enough, I'd like to check out some of the DLC. And the, um, the, lo the what is it, the signal void. And get started on that. Um, as well, I think that would be cool to explore. You know, we can use find a use for the battery here and um, those wires that we just saw. Oh, I'll take these boots for sure. Might leave the book. I'll take the book. Pinnacle Peaches can't open either of those two. We'll open this third one. Take the book just because fires uh, light at 80%, I think, with the book and a torch. So that's a good thing to consider. Actually, I might want to put these boots on now. Check this, uh, these file cabinets quick. And then we'll go see Dennis if he's hanging out over on the ledge. Nothing in either of those two file cabinets. And I'm stuck. Why? Don't know. Head over here. Dennis is usually perched up over there. At least the one time I've been here he was. I'm going to cross underneath. I, I see him. Through the light. Hey, Dennis. What you got? Anything? Nope. And nothing. Oh, some socks in the backpack. We'll take it. 
Let's uh, change. Oh, I don't have shoes on. <laughs> I never put my shoes back on. Wonderful. And we'll wear both of those. Cool. Slowly getting warmer. That's the name of the game. Grab this piece of reclaimed wood and we'll head down this way. Anything of interest? There's a fire barrel right in there. I grab this wood first. And then let's go drop off some gear quick and then we'll go do a haul and a little loot through this area. Drop that, we'll drop those. Drop those, we'll drop that as well. I'll drop all these. And that's good for now. I don't think I'm gonna light a fire. Maybe I should. I'll, I'll open that a bit. I would like to find a cooking pot. Real quick, let's check upstairs. And just finish that out before we search the rest of the downstairs. Empty can, some sardines. I'll drop them if they're if they're low on uh if they're low condition. None of those sodas are good. Anything over here? Nothing under the bed. Can I fall through one of these holes? I bet you I could fall through there. Uh we got a plastic container right here. And is that another box of matches? It sure is. Okay, cool. We got three boxes of matches. That is awesome. I, I'm, I don't have a better a better word for it, but that's awesome. We found three boxes of matches. Uh, I will most likely eat. I'm definitely going to eat that um, maple syrup. I didn't realize how, how low my condition was. It's the one stat I wasn't looking at. Um, I'm sure people are screaming at me going, he's just slowly dying. Uh, leave those fuses. I'll take the note left behind. I'm not going to read it because uh, I forgot to. We're going to start this fire um, because I need to warm up. Uh, let's get a f torch going. And then I think I'll, I can burn the book. Did I drop the book? I did. Uh, start fire. What do we got? Flame wood, 30%. Shooting guide. I didn't look at. Give me the book. There you go. Let's do it. Start fire. 80%. Yeah, let's get that going. I'm going to heat up uh, the one of the teas that I have. And that'll kind of give us some warming up while we're in here. And we'll get this fire going. I don't want to sit next to this fire the whole time. But if we can at least get a tea, get some water going, and uh, warm up a little bit, that should stop the condition loss at least. I need to actually put some fuel in it before we get to... Before we let it die. Alright, we're going to cook some more water. All right, cool. That's warming us up. And let's drop the teas. Okay, those are in position. They'll warm up fairly quick. I'm warming up fairly quick anyways. Two hours and 50 minutes. That's melting, and those are pretty good. I'm actually gonna go see if we can crack this safe quick and head back. 24, 11. And 27. Another maple syrup and another scarf. And I can't stand up again. How we doing? All right, let's move these and the water. Eleven minutes till boiled. We got two reishis, so I'm gonna. Actually, I don't know if I really need to drink them. 
Can I heat up some food? What do we got? Uh, pork and beans. I'm going to eat this sardine at 62%. Should be fine. And do I want to drink one of these teas? I think I do. I need to warm up. And I need my condition to, to increase. I am losing condition, it says. Why? What's the problem? Is it the clothes that are wet? Probably. Alright, we're gonna walk around in our underwear a bit. And that should do it. And that's gonna be done. Let's make some more. Alright, let's check out here. For anything of interest. I'm not seeing anything over there. Nothing hidden in the crevices. Is that back there? A drain, it looks like. Some sort. Okay. Uh, what do we got? Anything back here? Those clothes should be dried up pretty soon. More wires? Yeah. Take the flare. Just check the toolbox. Nothing in the first drawer. Nothing in the second drawer. Anything under here? No. Anything over here? No. It's actually a little bit more barren than I thought it would be. Though we did find, I think, two boxes of matches. Was the other box in, um, I'm forgetting. Was it in, uh, the Riken? That. Owner of the shelf. Oh, the pallet. Okay. Anything else over here? Just this metal container. Do we go? No. I was going to say, do we go for where Fluffy is? And then I remembered last time I encountered a wolf. I got murdered pretty much instantly. We're not going to go bother Fluffy uh, while we're in Desolation Point. We'll have to come back and see him another time. So let's go ahead and just check everything here. 15 minutes until boiled. That's clean. Or that's dry. Dry and dry. Let's put those back on. And what do we got? That and those. Okay. Perfect. 11 minutes until boiled. Those are still hot. What else do we have? We search this, yes. Yep, search under there. Anything, anything on these shelves? Thought that was a hacksaw for a second. Not finding much on the tool front. Was kind of hoping at least here or the Riken would have had a hacksaw for us. If not the heavy hammer. But, you know, there's not much we can do about it. There's still the outside area. We can um we can go explore. Got an hour on this barrel. An hour forty on the barrel. I'll take this water and let's cook off another batch. An hour and thirty. I'm not sure if I wanna stoke the fire or come back and do it. How, what do we have on us? Let's add at least that. It gives us two hours. And let's head out this way. I believe this exit here will take us out. Do I even need to crouch? No. It'll take us out to where that um, memento stash is. So let's check. Because I believe it's right here. Uh, not here, but on this one. Yeah, there it is. So we can open this. And is there anything good in here? Marine flare? Oh, three marine flares. Nice. 
All right, we're cold. We got no bedroll. So we have to get out of here. Uh, and head back home, or at least to the Riken. But the Riken's cold, too. Oh, we can get in here, though. There's still hope. We could find a tool. We could sleep there if we need to. I'll take the food. I don't need another can of spray paint. Probably don't need the first one. Could sleep here if we want to. Tomato soup. Plastic container. Okay. I saw you back there. Dog food. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nope. Nada. Zilch. What else do we got? I don't see... Yeah, nothing. No tools. Alright, fair enough. It would be an insane kind of run if we were to find, I think... The tools we're looking for now. I mean, I would think that we just found three boxes of match matches. We got a Desolation Point spawn, which is pretty... Pretty... is one of the more safer areas. I could have got Timberwolf Mountain. Oh. There you go. There's a backpack. Don't know where that is. And let's go back inside, check our fire. And then um, we're going to go back inside. We'll check the fire. And then I think we're going to have to make our way back to the lighthouse as the weather's picking up. Hopefully we can make it back and we don't freeze to death because my condition is awfully low. All right, we're back inside. Take that. How much more fire do we have? An hour 28. Ooh, what do I do? Because the weather could turn at any second. Well, worst case scenario, if the weather does get bad enough. Oh, there's bunk houses all over there too. Worst case, we could sleep in the bunk house. I don't want to. There's not really much else. There's not really anywhere else to search. Oh, look, I found a crowbar. Um, there's not really anywhere else to search in this area outside of the three main buildings that we just searched and then that cave. But what the hell got stuck. Let's check these lockers, I guess. Well, I kind of think about the next steps. Heading back wouldn't be the worst. But staying here wouldn't be the worst either. Nothing. And this one was good, right? Yeah, we searched that one. Alright, well, at least we got the, um... I feel like I didn't do a very good job. Distress pistol. Uh huh. I did not do a good job. We're gonna have to go back to the Riken, I think. Because I went through this quick and I missed two major pieces of equipment. Do this one more time. Oh, can I sleep here? Oh, I can sleep in this building. I don't even need to leave. Alright, that's good to know. Oh my god. Stay on target. That's the frontier hunting one that I thought. It's stay on target. Oh, we're probably going to end up spending the night here, I guess. I didn't search this desk either. Man, I'm rusty. There's nothing in it anyways. Uh, anything else up here that I might have overlooked? doesn't appear so I might pop back up there and check in a second but I want to just check this water before uh, it boils over 
another whetstone. I actually didn't know things could be uh, seated inside there, so that's something new. Nothing behind there. How we doing? Five minutes till boiled, and an hour left there. I'm gonna do one more check because I apparently I wasn't thorough enough. Nothing. Our condition looks like it went up a little bit. Maybe I'm maybe I'm mistaken. I'm trying to look at all the nooks and crannies now. Make sure I didn't. Uh, miss anything? I think this water's done. Yeah. Uh, what can I cook? The banged up. I guess. Which one of these are lower condition? 37, 31, 66. So let's cook this first. Gonna lose a little bit of it. Smashing it open. That's all right. But that'll give us a second can. Right? What the hell? Maybe after I eat it, I guess. But where did my old can go? Alright, we're going to do one more look. I'm going to be really upset if I leave a hacksaw behind. Because if we could get the hacksaw, we could almost stay just in this region. Could you, like, I can imagine it right now. Can you imagine it? If we could just find a hacksaw, we could get the process started. Look at that back there. And actually, I forgot. Give me the thing. Why can't I reach that? There's the hidden uh, spot up here, too, I almost forgot about. Right up there. Yeah, we're going to check that in just a second. I almost left without that, too. Yeah. Uh, take it. Kind of tempted to eat it now. If I eat it now, I can have the can. We could be doubling our water. I think that's a good move. Okay, why not? What is going on? Where's my can? Oh, that's right. You can't do it if the can is banged up. That's right. Okay. Well, then I didn't need to eat that yet, but whatever. What are we going to do? All right. There's a secret hidden stash up here. Oh, my God. It's so slow. Come on. I don't think I'm that heavy. Oh, I'll take the coffee. Cup of coffee. Doors. Anything else of note? Burn that book. Don't burn books, kids. Unless you absolutely have to. Uh, dog food, tin of sardines. Anything else of interest? Axon, maybe, you know, kind of. Uh, granola bar. Somebody ate an MRE. Couple, uh, couple snacks. Over here, no. But over here, no. All right, we got the plastic container. I got all the stuff there. It would be nice if I could stand up. And nothing over here. No. All right, cool. Not a terrible haul. Head back down. Check on things. There's that one little... Um, I just don't know. I, I don't know why I can't reach it. Maybe you gotta like cut this out and squeak back and uh, squeeze back there. I can't get it from here. It's just too far. But there's that metal container and I want it. All right, we'll do another check for that elusive hacksaw. We 
cool to find if I can. I love the bones in here, which I think I'm stuck on now. Yeah, I love the bones. That's such a cool looking like detail in uh in the processing center. It's so cool. It's it, it's such a unique location. Pallets and nothing back there. All right, I think we've been thorough so far on this side. I'll do another once over on the opposite side and I let this burn out like an idiot. Hmm. What to do, what to do. I don't want to really light another fire. Pick that up. Take that, take that, and we'll take that. And that. Oh, they were on top of each other? Ridiculous. How much water do I have? Almost a gallon. Okay. Can deal with it. Uh, I'm going to do one more sweep here real quick. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. I know, like, under here, uh, there was once a... um. In the use it to lose it challenge, there was a um, crowbar underneath there. Obviously we found one, but maybe a hacksaw could spawn. I don't know. Nothing there. Okay, nothing on that side. And I'm not seeing anything over here either that's jumping out at me. I do feel like I was fairly thorough in the bunkhouse. I don't know if I really want to check them again. Oh, I can't go that way. All right, we'll go. We'll go through here. And then I'm getting tired. Condition's going up. No, it's not going up, but it's not going down. The yellow little icons gone too, which is uh, always a good thing. And before I head outside, let's make my short. Yeah, before I go outside, let's make sure my shoes are on. All right. And then let's see, maybe, depending on how dark it is, how bad it is out, we might just go back to these bunkhouses and do one more search. I don't really want to walk around in the fog. Were any of these locked? I think these two were good. Search, yeah, I searched those. We'll do, we're going to check the bunkhouses because I don't remember if there was a locker or not that needed to be opened with a crowbar. So now that we have it, we should check. All right, cool, cool, cool. Those are broken. I thought for a second that was the hacksaw. I was about to lose my mind. Okay, I'm not seeing anything over there. Still nothing. Nothing back here. No bedroll. If I did want to sleep, it's plus five. It's doable. I don't know how late we could sleep in here, though. And that's, yeah, I already went in that one. I might just drink this tea. I think I'm going to, if they're still warm. Any of these teas still warm? Reishi or rose hip? I saw more reishis than rose hips around, so we're going to do that. That should warm us up. And we're going to head out. Oh, speaking of rose hips. Gonna head back to, I don't know yet. We're either gonna head back to um, the Riken or we're gonna head back to, to the lighthouse. I really don't wanna run into a bear out here cause that's gonna be game over too. And things are going so well for us.
Okay, there's some rocks. Some more rocks over here. I feel like... Well, we're still warm, so worst case... I will find either the Riken or... I'm either going to find the Riken, I'm going to find the lighthouse, or I'm going to find the bear. I'm just listening. I know we found the boat. Which is great. But I'm just listening because I do not want to run into that damn bear. All right, we're gonna go inside. Is it warm? No, it's not warm. This is where all our fire stuff is though, so we could light a fire to warm up. And then we could always go back to the lighthouse tomorrow, which I think might be the move. How late is it? Yeah, it's about to be dark. We're going to want to sleep. We need to recover our condition. We can do that here. I will need to start a fire. I do not think I can just sleep it off. I think I'm going to need to light another fire. We got plenty of matches. It's really not that big of a deal. We'll, uh, we'll light a fire, warm up, get ourselves nice and toasty. We'll warm up the tea. And then we can always drink that. And then that should get us through the night. Should we need to, should we need it? Yeah, let's do this now. All right, that sparked up. Put this away. Add and add the coal, and I guess elastic. I don't really need it. Two coals, probably fine, right? Cool. All right, let me. Can I cook water here? I can actually just boil that off. How are we doing on the water? Good. We're, we're full on water anyway, so we're good. Let's drop this tea. And then I don't... I'm not going to do the coffee. Because that's going to want to keep me awake. And I want to sleep. I am going to do this, though. And light that porch. Just to do one more once over. Like that bandage I missed. Just it was just too dark. Got all that here. Eleven minutes there. Nothing behind this crate. Nothing else in the crate. Anything over here. Nothing behind the shelf. In between these crates. Nothing behind them. Double check in here. Nothing on top of the file cabinets or behind those. Okay, I'm not seeing anything else. Okay, very good. Yep, there's some accelerant or lantern fuel. Yeah, so we definitely missed some stuff in the Riken as well. It's a good thing we came back. Uh, let's check the, the water. We'll take it and we'll take that. Let's go ahead and boil some more. Got two hours on that furnace. This uh, torch is going to last a little bit longer. Anything on this shelf or underneath it? Nope. Okay, and how about over here? Oh, we're going to go ahead and light a new torch. Alright, this one won't last as long as the other one. I got the uh, the the thermos that was there earlier. Uh, I will eventually fill it up. I don't like the thermoses that much. I love the fact that you can transport multiple teas in them. 
But I really don't feel like they keep things warm long enough. I know there's a balance to the game. Like, I missed this note too, right? Is that a note? Oh, that's just terrain? Okay. Uh, let's see. Just checking around. Uh, I got enough. Let's go outside for a second. Watch this blow out. Just making sure there's nothing here on this side. And I don't see anything. Head back in. Okay. Nope, don't do that. Right. Where's that torch that I threw? Pick that up. Okay. And, oh. I knew it. Son of a bitch. As soon as I came back, I was like, fuck that tea. We're going to be having a soup before we uh, go to sleep tonight. Just keep warm. What else do we got? All right, let's see. Uh, as far as beverages go, I think I don't have any. Do I? I got the coffee, which I'm not drinking. I will probably heat up the, um, like, tomato soup before we go to bed. Because that's the... I would like... I'm going to need to... I think in order to sleep here, we're going to need to be... Don't... Can I just see what... Oh, can I not sleep here? I can't sleep here. Yeah, you can. What is it? Plus 5.4. Okay. So, the warmth bonus is only 5.4. Which right now, it feels like 80 in here, which is great. But, that's not gonna last. Nothing else under there. I already got this um, metal container. There's nothing else there. I'm just checking one more time. So we'll come sleep here. We'll keep the, uh, we'll light the fire. I'll even stoke the fire a little bit before we go to bed. Just to be sure that we kind of make it through the night. But I'm thinking we drink tomato soup. That'll, uh, warm us up. It'll fill us up. And, you know, I could probably make it to the lighthouse. As much as I'm planning on going to bed right now, basically. It's not that cold, either. Alright, let's grab our stuff. I'm all over the place, I feel. But, I really don't need... We, we've searched all the rest of this place. It's still bright enough out. It's warm enough. Right now. We can just go. This isn't even that... Big of a deal. Okay. You could have just... I just wanted to get rid of it. Put that out. I'm going to grab a few torches since this fire is going here anyways. Uh, we're going to take it. We'll pick that up too. I'm going to take the rest of these torches. And we're going to head to... A lighthouse and I might throw in I have a few sticks left let me just harvest these real quick I get to them okay let's harvest takes two minutes Add those sticks. That stick. Alright, cool. We got 25 minutes. And let me harvest the rest of these. 
That'll knock off two. And the last one. And that last one. Right here, harvest it. Okay, and then we're gonna add the fuel. Three, thirty, and let's take the torch. Take the torch, and I th think it's got to be ten minutes or more on interloper. Yeah, so let's just add the one more stick. I don't care, and we'll take that torch too. Get out of here. All right, cool. We know the Riken is done. We know um, Hibernia is done. Like, we were pretty thorough in both spots. We're thorough in Desolation Point. Uh, God, I keep saying Desolation Point. We're we were thorough over in the Lighthouse as well. So I'm not really worried about that. But we've essentially went as far east as we needed to in this region. Searched all the main spots. We could keep going east a little bit more. The Bear Den's over there. Uh, there's a cave with Fluffy in it over there. Neither of which are really on my um, radar for places to search. I don't think there's any gear really in either of those spots that's worth it. I've never searched this island really. I don't think today's going to be the day. We head back to the lighthouse. We call it a night there. Probably call it a part there as well. And then next episode... We'll end up heading over to Katie's last stand. I think that'll be the plan. We'll check out her, her spot there. And then after that, we'll, I think, hit, hit up Crumbling Highway, probably. And then uh, after that comes Coastal Highway. So we can hit those two up. And depending on what we find there, we'll figure out if we're going to he head over to Pleasant Valley or if we want to head over to Mystery Lake. If our cards are played correctly, we may be able to actually get everything we need. And then, uh, oh, no, no, no. That what luck was that? I threw that torch down right on cracked ice. Managed to light it up no problem. It's only when I went to pick it up did I almost die. Ooh, my heart's pounding a little bit. Um, but if we play our cards right and we have our luck continues, we should hopefully be able to get everything we need in terms of tools on our way to Mystery Lake. And then we can just head right over to Muskeg and get the fire started and start smelting. Uh, I'm trying to remember the way to sneak up this thing. I think it's on the other side of this bridge. I think on the other side of this cliff here. We can actually climb up the cliff. We don't have to take the long way. And then we can head over back to the lighthouse. Not seeing anything as far as beachcombing. And fortunately haven't run into any wildlife yet, which I'm not complaining. They're around. Was it here? I think it is here. Oh, is it? Oh, maybe the next one. I think there's a boat over here, too. Yeah. I'm not going to search the boat now. I don't want to push it. Condition's too low. I want to get up top. And, oh, maybe that was it. All right, maybe we will search this boat. We'll get up top. I want to get inside before it gets too cold. Okay, nothing. Uh, metal container. 
Okay. Just nothing there either. All right. All right. We do have a torch. We're good on that. We're going to head to the lighthouse. And we're going to get some sleep. I'm going to eat, sleep, drink, get ourselves ready, climb into bed. We'll rest up. That'll restore probably our condition about halfway, I think. And then, yeah, it'll be a new day. I hear the wolves. I hear them. I'm trying to think if I was that, how thorough I was at the church, too. And then, should we search the cave before we leave? Oh, that's why. Because I had the hyperthermia. Come on, come on. Don't let it go out. Alright, cool. Um, I can't help myself. I mean, I guess I could, but I'll probably won't pick those up as much as I did last run. Uh, it was suggested, actually, that I don't. Um, but right now, with it being early, the weight's not really an issue, and there's no danger of the wolves or anything. If I just grabbed it, um, I'll probably harvest it for the stick. As uh, for now, well, let's head upstairs and let's top ourselves off. Uh, I'm going to get some sleep and I'll catch you in the morning. And drink it, yeah. Why? Well, what the fuck? Why, man? I know it was cold. I know it was cold. But 31 plus 9 is 40 degrees. I'm, I'm above freezing. So why wouldn't I had all my stats up? All my stats were up. I filled my water. I filled everything. I'm sleeping. Why wouldn't that have healed me? I don't get it. Well, dang. That was a run. Um, so new record is uh, in, the, in Interlopers, one day. So look at us go. Um, all right. Well, that's going to do it for this one. I was hoping to keep this series going. We had such a good start, man. But it is what it is. Um. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. If you're interested in more uh, Long Dark content, uh, please consider subscribing, and I will see you all in the next attempt. <laughs> Bye, guys.